Welcome to Cole Outdoors. I am your host, Derek Cole, and if you're new here, please consider subscribing. Please like my video, and please let's share the video. Let's see how many shares we can get on this video. Let's aim for 15 today. So today, I am going to go over five tips for fishing northern lakes. And if you're up north or you're going to fish up north, this is the video for you. You will catch more fish by studying this video. I've been fishing northern lakes my whole life. I know them. I've learned how to fish these lakes and I know how to get bites when no one else does. I know how to quickly dissect these ones and I'm going to give you five quick tips to you to dissect the lake and quickly decide how and where you're going to catch your fish. So the first tip I'm going to give you is use your eyes. The first thing I do before I even get to a lake, especially up north, is I study the maps. I look at them. I, I try, try to figure out well, how deep the lake is and if possible what kind of, of uh, bottom does it have. <coughs> I always look, the first thing I do when I get to the lake, I always look and see what kind of grass I can see. There's still a lot of grass there, there's a lot of grass there. I mean that can key me in to where I'm going to fish for it and where I'm going to fish for it. So the first thing I decide when I get to a lake, am I fishing for smallmouth, largemouth or both? If the lake is deep and there is a hard bottom or sand and the water is crystal clear, 99 out of 100 times I am going to be looking for smallmouth because largemouth don't simply exist in the lake. So I, then I look at another thing, if I'm looking for largemouth in the lake, usually the water, there's lots of weeds and the water is dirty. And if that's the case, largemouth's the game. And if you find a lake where both are present, then you can fish for either species. And then it's just the idea of doing some pre-fishing and determining which fish is going to be bigger, but you know what fish you're going to target on game day. Another thing that people that are traveling up here from the south don't realize is the, is the bass seem to be relatively shallow compared to down south. Down south, the water heats up a lot faster than up north, and the water is simply colder. So I got a couple more tips for you guys, and these are lure choices. If you've never used a tube on these bait, on these kind of waters, use a tube. Up north, tubes are one of the best things to dissect a lake with. And I always use my jig head inside the tube and fish it that way. Gets this work great if you know where it gets it is. But before I even start fishing for these, I will actually use crankbaits and locate these bass. So my next tip is on the drop shot rig. A lot of people up north make big mistakes on the drop shot rig. They tend to cast it out and put way too much action in their drop shot. Just cast it out, they make subtle moves. Subtle moves with the drop shot rod will make great action on your rod. Well thank you guys for watching today. I am your host Derek Cole. Until next time, keep fishing, keep it real. Later.